next year. Giving it your all, your state champion tonight. How does that feel? Too good, unbelievable. How's it feel right now, Finn? Incredible. I mean, we've been working so hard all year. I dreamed of this moment. I can't even, it's all over my head right now. I can't even believe it. We wanted it so bad, straight from the beginning of the season. We just set goals. It wasn't we didn't want to win a semi game, we didn't want to win a quarter final. We said we wanted to win a state championship. And it starts with all the little things. It starts with every ground ball, every pass, and everything on and off the field. The boys have such a strong connection. And I'm so happy to be on part of this team. I'm Brendan Faulkner. I graduated 2022. We all went through something uh, together you know, in that season that was special. Um, and, you know, just that memory that we share together, I think we'll always remember. Uh, and I still keep in touch with a lot of these guys today, um, older, younger, um, you know, we're all still very close today because of what we went through together. Uh, it was very important. Um, and I think it was just a different perspective on things and being able to see things from a different point of view um, and just be proud of the guys that were playing um, I think it was a special way to look at things, and uh, I think it was still a very, very memorable experience. Um, my favorite part about playing lacrosse is, or was, I guess, definitely just the, the connections that we made and the memories we made, um, going to practice together, waking up on Saturday mornings and, and still getting out and getting to practice and trying to get better. Our job as seniors um, was really just to kind of show them what it's like um, and what it means to play on our team. And I think they kind of just took it into their own hands um, and filled the shoes as, as they knew they needed to. That's cool. Is that the real USC? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> cool, cool. I'm a fan of the Cox. Good Cox, baby. Yeah. I saw it the first time. action today dudes again I'm just really grateful for what we have like I told the seniors last night the groups at Arapaho that have had the most success it's just about like loving everybody on the team and being as tight as you can on the field but more importantly off the field right this is our group this is our group that we're in the foxhole with this is our group that we're in the trenches with you know and this is the group that we're gonna battle with highs and lows ups and downs the entire way through this year and it's gonna be a long one and that's a good thing I like a long journey it's gonna be fun for us we got to start locking in and start making connections and building trust with everybody in this group. It's got to happen. So start, you know, when you get to breakfast, sit with dudes who you don't know. And so take some time to get to know guys who you might not know otherwise. We'll go from there, all right? Once in my life, I have How's it feeling? Tastes great. Tastes great. Second cup this morning. Hi, Mom. Bad Red Rocks. Uh, Pancake House with the guys. What are your thoughts right now? I need to order. Tired, I'll be but, back. Junior year, big so year I'm throwing all my friends on the shit. Goals, that's pretty much I know I'm not worried about that. worried about, you know, and I'm done. Play your game. Love that. Um, somebody once told me that you're a player. <laughs> Are these allegations true or false? Uh, kind of depends on what you do. Oh, okay. okay. Well, how, how would you define yourself if I was to define you as a player? 
<laughs> hey, Grub, Grub, what did you order, by chance? Uh, I ordered a full stack of French toast with a side of biscuits and gravy. <laughs> And I got the cowboy omelet. It's the biggest omelet here, smothered in sausage gravy with some pancakes. Maria Bales, um, William Bales, and um, Will. Will Bales. So, brought, uh, BTR stands for Brought to Reality, and our son started Brought to Reality, which is a clothing brand when he was a sophomore in high school at Arapaho. And what it meant to him uh, stepping outside of reality, drinking, drugs, cutting, burning, is a dangerous place to be. So he wanted to um, establish the brand that would encourage kids to find the reality and not try to escape. How does Arapaho support, after all these years, affect the brand and what it means? So the Arapaho community has been uh, tremendously supportive, more so than I could have ever hoped for. Uh, actually, Logan was uh, the first coach to allow us to talk to the players and talk about Nick's story. And he was the first coach to allow the BTR stickers on the helmets. And because of that, we've made it a really strong effort to try to get uh, the BTR de decals on other local, other Arapaho teams, other local sports teams, as well as some of the local uh, colleges. Why is mental health so important in today's society and how can lacrosse be a positive outlet? So everybody is going through something that you know nothing about, right? So statistics say one in five will struggle with a major episode of mental health at some point in their life. And that can be currently in the past or obviously in the future. Um, everybody's mental wellness is different, so there is not one um, in-the-box type therapy. So that's one of the things that BTR is all about, is, is understanding that sitting on a couch um, may not be the right type of therapy for you. And BTR tries to find different types of therapies um, that, that, that might work for somebody else. Also, um I, I would say that our community here at Arapaho High School and through the surrounding area has been, I mean, the love and the support that we've received from them since we lost our son has been just unbelievable and amazing all at the same time. Um, it's, and it's because of them that it's allowed us to be a voice for our community with mental health in the sports world, in the schools, and anybody who will listen. Like they support us 100% and they're helping us spread the message as well. I think, I think everybody has been touched by suicide to some degree, right? Whatever degree of separation it is. And everybody understands that it's real. And uh, I think a lot of the families understand that it could happen to them or somebody in their family. I mean, you know, everybody, most people who struggle with a mental illness, they're wearing a mask. 
So you'll see them smiling, happy on the outside, but deep down inside they're struggling and to the point where they're even contemplating suicide. So it's really important to always check in on your family members, your friends, um, anybody that matters to you and just truly ask them, how are you doing? What's going on? And you can talk to me, I'm here for you. How important, or how has the Arapaho community changed BTR? And how important is like the ongoing relationship as the years go on? <clears throat> I would say uh, where we are today is 100% um, due in part to our community, the Arapaho community. If it weren't, if it wasn't for um, the the athletes' support, the coaches' support, the administration's support, the family support, um, we can't do what we've done without that. And it's again, it's 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 overwhelming. Um, where where the youth has taken BTR and Maria and BTR consists of really just Maria and myself and then the community. There are so many, like you're doing this interview right now, right? Um, you're doing this because you know this will help somebody, right? Whether it be a, 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 somebody on the team or a friend that's going to be seeing this, um, BTR would not be where it is today. Like, how can people support BTR and how can they reach you guys? For me, what, um, you know, supporting BTR for me would be buying the brand, wearing the hoodies and the t-shirts. Um, that was Nick's dream, was to have a clothing brand that had a purpose behind it. So if you wear BTR, it's just important because we like to say that if you're wearing BTR, you either are somebody who struggles, know somebody who does, or want to help those that do. So we've been told many times by kids that when they see somebody else wearing BTR, they can actually approach them and say, you know, I feel like you're my friend already just because there's that connection of BTR. So the best way to support us is to purchase the hoodies and the t-shirts and put those stickers on your car. and. Also by donation, we definitely will take donations. We, um, what BTR is doing now is we have turned it into a foundation. It's a 501c3. So with every single profit that we make, every penny will go directly towards paying for kids to get therapy that otherwise could not afford to do that. So we just never want a kid to ever feel like, you know, their only answer is suicide because they couldn't, you know, because they didn't have the funds, we want them to be able to come to us so that we can help them get the therapy that they need so that they can live a great and wonderful, successful life. I mean, it's not something that will ever go away. Mental illness, it's real, it's a disease, but with the right tools, you can live a happy and healthy life. So our website is brought2reality.com. Our Instagram is at BTR Clothing. Um, just supporting our social media too is a, is a big deal. It's that time. Things just ain't the same for young Jermaine Still underrated but far from underpaid And though some problems did fade the hunger stay These stomach rumbles could humble thunder uh, I'm still fueled by the ones that slumber To stand out amongst the one hit wonders So when the dust settles and the sun is under the horizon Y'all should run the numbers uh, Who the want what with me? Heart is out and I say that reluctantly Cause it should go without saying But y'all playing dumb Far as these rappers go I'm not fearing none Cold flow is cold at any genre with many combinations shoot like that boy sponsored by underarm uh, when i think about our team i think about family how you bring a knife to a gunfight they gonna always do it twice when it's done right i remember riding around to the sun like come up I ain't trying to argue so i hung up these boy fresh with it on me know how i pop out they not important what I'm all about. Don't play with baby, I give you something to cry about. That's a dime, that's for you and for your friends to fly out. Every time we outside, it be going up. I got women trying to get at me like you.